guys. Big up yourself. Just dropped the lines in. Just got on spot. Me and Laurie's here. Early in the morning, guys. Just making sure fishing here, guys. <laughs> A little bit of excitement already this morning. And I actually got the camera on a tripod today so I can actually have my hands free and not have to worry about the camera while I'm recording. Yeah. I don't think I got fish on yet, people. Yeah, bait's gone. Nothing on this one, guys. Let's see what we can get up here. So basically, I'm running a T-knot. Double hooks. One-knot hooks. Three-ounce weights. Um, on an eight-foot with a 30-pound leader. So, 30 pound nylon and 30 pound leader. Well, there goes daylight, guys. That's what I was looking for. I know it's still cold, but sooner or later, you're going to have to take the jackets off. It's going to get really hot. The sun's going to come up. We're going to get this one out, guys. They're definitely hitting guys. Let me show my camera's focus right back here. Yeah guys, water's looking extremely good this morning. So what I'm basically gonna do, I'm gonna pull my lure out and I'm getting a response from all my lines. I'm setting shrimp this morning, but the water's really looking good for my lure. So they might be a barracuda or a snook or something hanging around here. I'm gonna go hunting for it. That's what's up. Let me get my lure out. My lure rod out. <sighs> And bells get on your nerves sometimes. Especially when there's no fish on the line. Yeah guys, so get my leader line out along with my lure. High vis lure. The water is clear, but I want to use something a little bit high vis this morning. I actually changed my lock rings last night on my lures because I realized that it got rusted, so my split rings, sorry. Let me Got some new hooks on my lures too. Put some new treble hooks on some of them last night. So extra sharp hook for those extra sharp barra teeth. Don't no worry. Thank you. Alright. So guys, I'm gonna scan this side of the water first. Let's see what I can pick up. This was hitting off. I had these lines set. We're not watching that. We just don't want to get in my buddy's way. So uh not blocking his thing. Yeah. Sorry, hold this up. Let me get this camera off. Off the tripod. Bang, bang. Hey guys, water is extremely clear this morning. Nothing yet, guys. Alright, hold this. Careful, watch the hook. Give me that weight. I'll just run one hook on this. Don't worry about changing the rig. That's why I carry the extra weights just in case. I thought you were going to a bag to circle. Mm-hmm. At least. <clears throat> I'm not going this morning. Careful. Welcome. Give me that. Just let it go. Empty hooks coming back, Russ. So they out here. If I'm getting empty hooks, I'm getting bites. Is it me? Eh? Yeah, man, but crabs at work, so are the bigger fish. Based on what Mr. McBride didn't come down here, I can't catch the day before yesterday. I know they're running down here. And the bait fish are here, so they're hungry. They're gonna come in. And look at here, look in front of us. All bait fish, look, the whole school. Whole of yasso. Hey, I'm a biting on, but here where did I beat with? With the dip on one cliff side, and when you carry up the fish, them so high, then pop off the blood peak because they're so heavy. You understand? So you have to have like one basket or something to carry them up. They reach you out the wicked, man. And we catch fish, you know? Bridging catch, shoot one 23 pound fish to blood peak. Cray, 23 pound amberjack. Big? Yo guy man place bridging, the man no shot with nothing, chill, you see me? Portland people different, you know. 
Watch your head there, Parry. Just slide it, slide forward, man. Just so. I don't, I don't want to lick you with the rod. Come on, we up down there. Oh, shit. <laughs> I found last night, don't you know, there? Eh? I'm just making sure fishing here, guys. We're getting the action. Look, we're getting a hit. Getting a hit, guys. Well gone, Bossy. Hold on, man. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I do I don't I Oh, crab them at work, you know, man. I crab out there sitting there, you know, man. Only one crab feed. Watch your face. Yo, <laughs> And then we have let go come we are now in a in a next month again. Let go? Lent, lent. Yeah man. See what your mother gonna take back in a catch back. Put fish and kill after years. Now again I might catch one like a five or one six four. A serious thing man, when they get breezy and cold, slow down bad for the bite. You know when we do parry, we go south coast. Yeah. South coast the money there man. No fish no there, so south coast the money there. You know see when we go up on south coast when we catch? I be 11 pound and 10 pound fish. Look here, look here, look here. See if I hunt there. No? Alright. Oh, we had a goat? Yeah, yeah. Uh, you, you can go on that line, you have to hear? Look here, no? Just go so. Calf. Okay. All right. Hey, you know, say, so I first me ever see one of the line, I shut off one boat engine. Yeah. One brother come in, like I say, me have my line, them said, said, where so, but far it up on the tip out, that's I tell them, say, yo, yo, the man have in line said. And far it right up. No man, a border. A border it happen. Oh, oh, oh. I mean I'm a line set across the harbor. And a blood cleat man shot down there, you see man. When I line cut him across his chest, you know, one touch him on his nose, you know. Yeah. And the other one hole in a boat engine and lock off the boat engine, you have it up. Block you off. I may tell me, I say, brother, who's you? You didn't mush up the engine. I say, brother, you know how much line you just mash up? <laughs> 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 Yo, me never know, that's a 30 pound nylon strong. It pulled the boat, comes straight across the harbor. I was like, oh, sh one day behind you, yes, sir. Here, see, man. One yellow one. That's why I get high vis color here. No, brother, but a, a 4,000 dollars per 150 yard of this, you know. And a 500 yard hit me up on you know. So now, me have line to go all the way out to a reef to save the fish for running, you know. That's how we live for Amazon, man. Me? Amazon, yeah, it's expensive. Well, it's still cheaper when you buy a Jamaica. Yeah, yeah. no, it's more, it more cheaper when you buy it on Amazon, but when you buy a Jamaica, it's going to charge you $4,000. No, no, it's more cheaper you buy it than, than the Jamaica. Yeah, 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 it is. Yeah. It's actually about cheaper your price, you pay people to go to Mmm. <laughs> but the whole thing, the line never busts, and I'm going to get back all of my line now. I'm going to get back every single piece of my line, but it never busts. Sitting and chase them over there, so man, look, look. I'm sitting there chasing over there in the corner What about that? Water looks good enough peeps Mmm You get something Rasta? Yeah man Rasta get something from the handline people Hope you have something good you can get Yes sir Rasta you get a flounder 
Pull him in, pull him in. Oh, Stingray. Stingray. Jaja. Jaja, God. Jaja, God. Jaja, God. Jaja, God. Jaja, Jaja, God. 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 Jaja, Come on, Rory, look at the horses. Look at the horses. What kind of line are you Eh? What kind of Nylon braided. Yeah, I'm um, casking 30 pound superpower braid. All of them is casking. Everything when we use from a line are casking. So that's a yellow, but it's faded out. I had this like three years already. The line on here, so. Oh yeah? Go ahead. Go ahead. Big piece of shrimp on there for you, boy. You over some. You over some man. I mess with them man, but you know I take on for the lure them, so I tried three different lures already. Yeah, yeah. No, nah, sir. You may get touched, you know. In time. Let me get touched. Oh yeah. Fish on. Larry, hold this for me. Take this. Fish on. Hey yeah, guys. First catch. Yeah. Fish on guys, they're making sure fish in here. Man, you're acting like he was all that big. Look at this guy, man. Look at the size of him. Give him my bait back. What should I do with it? Huh? Cook it! That's my first catch. That's my break my duck's catch. That's a break your duck's catch. Uh -huh. Right now, I'll string one, I'll string up and put him back for catch a barrel. Sit, I set back a little snapper there for you, barrel. Right sit, I should not set him for him, yes, because they love barrel, they love snapper, you know, man. Which one? Oh, which one go off? Go off. I think one of them are Hold on. Yeah, hit people. Yeah, fish on, guys. Yeah, fish on again, guys. Be a little fryers. Smile one, man. Yeah, dog. Look at this, man. Fish for dinner. So, what you can do, go look stick for like the fire. I roast those two little fish for you right now. That's why I brought the grill. That's how I'm scared the grill come. So, in case we stuck here and you want to roast up fish while we're here, we do it. So? Oh, I'm so going to do it. Give so no idea, we just practice with you look grill top with me. Alright, Larry. Yeah, we light up a little fire right there. That's where the tree's at. Yeah, you're making sure fishing guys. Get some little fryers. Laura said she's hungry guys, but I'm not throwing these back. I'm gonna throw them on the grill for Laurie and let him eat these. Get her some protein in her body real quick guys. If you don't care, just go wash you off and I'll make you drop in that water. Right there, it's just so. Yes, Where are you fishing right there? Yeah. Hmm? Uh -huh. Trying to drop in my water? No. Yeah, just wash out. Yeah. Wash out, man. Go on. No, I'm going to use that. Who else is looking for people? Um, we've been out here since 4 o'clock this morning. And this is what I've caught so far. <laughs> it's a joke, but unfortunately, she wants to eat them. So, fortunately. Let's go. 
cool, man. What's that? Open the bag up and give me some of my seasoning for them. Sprinkle a little bit on it. Now just reach in your hand, just take your hand and just take, pinch your hand and just throw in a little bit in there. Mm. Pinch some, pinch a good amount. Alright, come. Sprinkle it in my glove. Sprinkle it, man, all over it. Sprinkle it. Next one. Mm. Alright, so just put them on it. Come. Mm -hmm. Yeah, guys. Come on, Larry. Showing you how to roast your own fish. Alright, so I actually didn't need that mm -hmm. much seasoning. No, just put it up, the rest of it, in case we catch. So, what you do when they, they roast on one side, you just flip it. Alright, okay. I'm gonna go down here and get my lines baited back up. If you have to use the knife and flip it, you understand? Yeah, so I'm showing Laurie how to roast our own fish. So the two local fish I'm going to catch. Light up our local fire gear, put our local grill, make sure roast our own fish. So these are the things growing up as a kid, man. Yo, you see, you see, that's why I'm saying, yo, fathers are important in people's lives, man. They are, because they teach them the way, bro. And she'll teach her kids the same. Yo, you know me and my dad used to do this? Outside. Outside. Hmm? Welcome. I just may I put back in my cooler. There's something that bite me like one red ants so are sitting bite me. Red ants, there is red ants. Close up the cooler properly, so I know. So where do you just go so? Flip them so. You see me? Sorry. Yeah man, just flip them. You see me? Look at the eyes, oh my god. Yeah. Roast them or roast man. So if you just like every like look at one minute, you just flip it. Just make it roast look a bit again like what I did. And just flip it back again. Turn your line and check them now. They might come in now, you know. You see them only leak harder and harder. Harder, the line will move harder, don't. No? Flip your game, Larry. Then suppose you can't come off now, you know. Can I take that long for roast? Now come. Mm -hmm. Jack fish them out there, you know. Mm -hmm. So nice. Jack around the place up on the other day. Eh? Yeah? I'm going to shut down this aside. You're good, man. Sorry. Good, man. I just want to pin the line here real quick. Hit it, no man. Knock you knocked about three times already. <coughs> mm. What happened? Why am I gonna take them out? Eh? Yeah, man, you can't go and mash up them lorry, man. Eh? Mm hmm. They're yeah, Jamaican short fish and just a roast two fish with Larry, isn't it? Catch two local fryers, look while and so I'm not going to show them back still because we're there, so we're not leaving the fishing spot for a while and she's kind of hungry, guys. So, just basically lift this up and just, just got her something to eat real quick. So, you call this real survival, guys. I didn't bring any snacks, I didn't bring any munchies. I just came out here fishing and we just brought water to drink and that's it. So, um, this is it, guys. This is what's up. I gotta put it on the what? On the cooler top, right? Uh -huh. Let me open up the top. And you put it on the inside of this right here. 
So we'll get Laurie her roast fish people. Okay, I want to so look a bit more. Okay. Go on. So what you do? You, you could break the skin off and eat the inside. Don't eat the scale because remember it's in the scale, all right? I know. <laughs> Take your time. Yeah. All right? And then when you're ready for the next one, you just take it off, all right? It'll be right here, just soaking like that. All right? Okay. All right, babe. Thank you, buddy. No problem. <clears throat> yeah, guys, so one rod's down here, two rods set up here. My lower rod's up there, guys. So I'm basically working this pair, trying to get, um, See what we can pick up i doubt if this has bait on it still but let's see what's up let, let, let it wait for a little bit see if that barrel is hunting still out here and if he's gonna get bold today long jaw chasing i mean it's, visibility is good on the lure let's get it out of here see what we can pick up Laurie's good? Huh? How was it? It's good? You okay? That's good, right? I know. Yeah, guys. This is what's up. So I set one line down here by Laurie. Just in case it goes off, she can pay attention to it Did while I'm up. Laurie? Laurie. Oh. Oh. Line set. Let's get back up here to these guys. This is how I cover more area. I can drop one line down there. My own deer. My own deer, so I just cover more area, bro, and it just gives me more. more yeah. I just want at least a good five pounder or two pounder, something like that within that range. I was in the mood for fresh fish, but I was not going to buy it. Hey, Rasta. Rasta. Rasta Farai. Yeah, man. I have some special glasses I'm use for this, you know. But they got damaged the other day when I left them up there at the ranch. Yeah, man. Man, I sent him. Did you want to reach this morning? Mm -hmm. But because this girl's mother's come to pick her up, I had to stay close to home. Check, man. Check that next one, yato. Yeah, because it likes to fish them start lick harder. As soon as the line drop in that water, so yeah. they're hitting it. Say, say, gone, Parry. As you touch the water, that's the blood, please. Why am I taking a man? I'm gonna play with it for. Come on, man. No long may I wait for you for a morning. Yes, I. Fish on, guys. Fish on. You're making sure fish it. I've been asking for this bad boy all morning. Come here. Uh -huh. Come here. Where you go? Uh huh. Look at this little mother. Yo, you going right on the grill. He's going on the grill. Larry, Larry what do you say? Yes? On the grill. Larry's hungry, man. <laughs> Larry ain't pampering nothing today. She's like, yo, daddy, grill. What's up? But uh, let's get him over there and get him on Laurie's grill real quick, guys. All right, he's not playing with these fish today, guys. Okay. Is that the next one? Okay. Yeah. You ate it all? <laughs> yes. Damn, girl. You going hard. All right, let me dispatch this guy real quick. Anyway, aren't you going to eat something? Mm -hmm. 
What's that? Guts. Fresh fish. Two minutes out of water. Still flapping, guys. Little fish. Other fish. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. This one didn't go off yet? I don't see it go off. Huh? I don't see it go off yet. Get the seasoning out. Come on, seasoning, come on. All in there. Come on, more. More? Mm hmm. No, oh, he's still flapping, right? Look. Oh my god! <laughs> come on. Is that dead? I told you you're going to eat him alive. No. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to die anyway. Alright, there. there you go. You got another fish. That's three fish already, you know. <laughs> Fresh fish, guys. Me and Laurie just having fun. She's just eating. Fresh fish, guys. Look at that eel. Look at him. Oh. You see him? Oh my god. No way. He's going for the fish guts that I just threw in the water. <laughs> he almost got me, too. What do you mean by he almost got you? Bite. Don't like do that. You don't see it's like a snake? Dad, come on and do that. I'm not going there. I'm not going there. What if it takes your life? Nah. Then we'll cook him too. Remember to flip the fish. Wah. Look at that drummer. Oh, as I got here. No, this is a whitening. That's a nice size whitening, bro. Nice, 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 nice fish, bro. Good catch, bro. Alright. Here, guys. They're starting to come in now. It's that time. Let me get baited back up and get in the water again. Laurie's enjoying herself roasting fish. <laughs> yo, she just like, yo, daddy, another one? What? Send on. <laughs> yeah, that's the part about growing up in Jamaica, guys. And um, being a kid in Jamaica and living in Jamaica, and especially chilling out with your dad or something like that. Little nemities to it, you know? Hey, yeah, guys. More shrimp from the box. You all right? Give me some shrimp. Mm -hmm. What you do, you just push up the wood under there so you can burn a little bit better. You understand? Mm -hmm. You can get some more stick. Put some more stick in it so keep the fire going too. So. I just flipped it. Okay. Close the cooler. Yeah, guys. That's what it's all about. Just making sure fishing. Somebody's come with a fishing rod, guys. Somebody's rolling with a fishing rod. Oh, like, no, I'll stop. Eh? Somebody gone back. I care for him, though. Yo, they eat nice. They dry fry them. It's called a whitening. We get some big one down here already, all two pounds. Yeah. Going back out again. So, you know, here this line go off no time. Now watch him, man. Watch this, Larry. Uh -huh. Watch your fish and stuff. We are going to suffer water. See you. See you, man. Big one in touch, you know. Mm -hmm. Big one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Amazon. Avil, big wild beer, I sell them, you know? Yeah. 
For $1,000 or four, him sell them for $5, there's a four, something like that. He may have a number, me give you a number. Six. Eh? With a barrel? In the boat, I know, 4.1, the boat, I may hunt. But you now pick up on the load this morning. I'm real to make a sure fishing man. Oh, go on, you good? Yeah, man, yeah, man. Cool, man. Subscribe, you know? Yeah, man, bless up, bless up. Hunt lights on the company, hunt this morning. Yeah, man. Yeah. 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 I want to do it up here, you know? Eh? I want to do it up here. Come see us up. Come see us up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. I'll get prepared. Yeah. You think you want a small one, the funny thing? See there? See there? Come on, come on. Yeah. That went off. It's bending over. All right. Just pay attention to it. Eh? What that? Um, Amazon. Oh, Amazon. Amazon, Amazon, Amazon. Yeah. So what happened is I can leave one rod down there, one rod up here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah this is a pen rod. Yeah. Five, um, six toes. Six toes, not thirty pound drug. Yeah, I had this for about five years now. It's going good. Never gave me no issue. Service it once. That's it. And I paid $64 for it. Yeah. Now, unlike this reel now, the DG series, mm -hmm. now that's that's the hundred and hundred and twenty dollar reel. Oh. Yeah, the Daiwa BG series. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, the lure uh, um, Daiwa? Lure. No, the lure is um Origam. Origam. Ori Origam. Origam. This company that I found out of Japan. Oh. But they lure, they make very good lures. So I just buy it in a pack of ten or twenty. So I just have different different lures to use. Okay, okay. So, so my one change. No, I know that. That's for sure. I've killed so much fish on these things already, bro. I've killed so much. Feel, yeah. all right. Feel the barrel teeth. Feel it. Just doesn't feel the barrel teeth tonight. This has already killed five, six barrels already on this mm. same lure. I just last night I serviced a couple of them. I change off this hook and some of the rings, and um, change off some of these rings. I'm gonna change these when I get home. I just did it quick because I was coming out this morning. Yeah, the, the, and the pink color one, nice. Yeah, the, the pink color one, my green and my white, I murdered a lot of fish. The natural color black, mm -hmm. also I murdered a lot of fish. Yeah, right yeah. yeah. Every time Billy. I'm Billy, maybe Billy. I'm a Billy, I yard. Yeah. 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 So what I do with this now, how I work this now, I have a 15 pound line. Mm 